definition of reflux is acid in the stomach coming up into the esophagus. Everyone has esophageal reflux. Every time you eat, you have some reflux, but some people are not able to push that reflux back down into their esophagus. And if that acid stays there long enough, you could potentially damage the esophagus or it can cause symptoms that could be debilitating. The most classical symptom of reflux is a burning pain in the epigastric area that goes up behind the sternum. We call it a retrosternal burning pain. Uh, that can be after you eat or can last hours after you eat. However, there are many other atypical manifestations of reflux. A cough, what we call a globus sensation where you feel like something is in your upper oropharyngeal area. Clearing of the throat. Asthma could be an atypical manifestation of reflux. It's okay to self-medicate if you're having significant symptoms once or twice a week and they're bothering you. And what we recommend you start using are H2 blockers like cimetidine or ranitidine, pepsid, and they do work to prevent symptoms and alleviate symptoms in about 50% of patients. They're not good at healing the esophagus. If the esophagus is undergoing damage, they're not good at that. If you're experiencing heartburn for more than five years uh, and you are a male above the age of 50, then you probably should be seen by a physician and consideration of an endoscopy uh, uh, should be done because it's the specifically the white male above 50 who's at most risk for the development of esophageal cancer. However, there are other potential complications of reflux, esophageal stricture, esophageal ulcers, uh, which can occur. Interestingly, 70% of people who have daily reflux symptoms, heartburn, have no damage done to their esophagus whatsoever.